Hello everyone. Today we're taking an in-depth look at the all-new, fully redesigned 2017 Jeep Compass. This is a Compass Limited shown in alpine white and has the black premium perforated leather interior. Officially replacing the outgoing previous generation Patriot and Compass, the new Compass will be the sole survivor of the twins as Jeep's premium compact SUV. The Compass will be available in four distinct trim levels. You have the base sport, the mid-level latitude, the luxuriously trimmed limited as this one is, and then you have the off-road capable Trailhawk. All the trim levels will, will be available with either front wheel drive or four wheel drive, with the exception of the Trailhawk trim, which will only be available in a four wheel drive configuration using Jeep's Active Drive Low four wheel drive system with the single speed PTU. And this four wheel drive model uses the Jeep Active Drive four wheel drive system and utilizes the Select Terrain Terrain Management Controller. It is powered by the 180 horsepower 2.4 liter Tiger Shark multi air four cylinder engine. And it is mated to the 9 speed 948 TE auto stick automatic transmission. The new Jeep Compass sits right in between the Renegade and the Cherokee as a mid-size compact SUV. As a brand new body style for 2017, the Compass retains its baby Grand Cherokee-like looks. Also blends it in a little bit with the Cherokee while retaining the familiar Jeep profile. And this vehicle does have the 18 inch painted and polished aluminum wheels. Sits on Continental Pro Contact 225-55 R18 tires. And this vehicle is equipped with the Command View dual pane panorama sunroof. Chrome accented side view mirrors have LED turn repeaters. And looking around the front, you have halogen automatic headlamps, piano black grille with polished chrome accents. All right, and this vehicle is equipped with remote start. To operate is easy, just double press the remote start button on the key fob. And utilizing Chrysler's keyless enter and go smart key access system, locking and unlocking the vehicle is easy by keeping the key fob on your person. To lock the vehicle, simply locate the black button on the door handle. The horn will chirp and the vehicle will lock. To unlock, simply grab the handle as you'd open it. And inside, power heated mirrors, power windows and power door locks. Satin silver trim. Accent stitching.
and inside. Eight-way power driver seat with four-way adjustable lumbar support. You've got a manual adjust passenger seat. Black leather with perforated inserts. Jeep logo. Height adjustable head restraints. And the color contrast stitching. Automatic headlamp and fog lamp control. Ambient light dim and instrument panel dim. Leather wrap, tilt and telescoping steering wheel with audio controls. Piano black accents continue on the dash. Alright, I'm panning through the interior and show, showing a little bit more detail. Satin silver trim continues on the steering wheel. You have your controls for your display computer. You connect Bluetooth and voice command controls, as well as your cruise controls. Thickly padded leather wrapped steering wheel. Does have the color contrast stitching as well. Moving down the center stack, the gloss black piano trim continues. We've also got dual air vents with shut off. And this vehicle is equipped with the navigation system. It also has dual zone climate control. Access to your Uconnect apps. This vehicle is Apple CarPlay and Google Android Auto ready. Inside your controls, you have your heated seat controls and heated steering wheel controls. This vehicle is also equipped with Sirius XM and satellite radio. Alright, moving down, redundant controls for audio and climate control. Select train train management controller. You connect inputs for audio or USB and auxiliary. And you've also got a 12 volt power point. Dual front cup holders, electronic parking brake, auto start stop feature, and your stability control. Nice amount of storage in the center armrest with a sliding center. Overhead, you do have an automatic dimming rearview mirror. You have SOS and Uconnect Assist. Sunroof controls on the left hand side is your shade, right hand is your glass, and your vent in the middle. Overhead reading lights, power lift gate release, sun visors with the integrated clip, illuminated vanity mirrors, and slide. Also have dampened overhead assist handles. All right, let's take a look at the rear seat. As you can see, the rear doors continues the same treatment. Rear seat does seat three across. It is a 60-40 split folding seat with high adjustable head restraints on all passenger seating areas. Contrast stitching and perforations continue in the rear as well. Fold down center armrest with integrated cup holders. Rear passengers do have positional air vents, a nice feature that was not present on the outgoing compasses. You've also got a 115 volt, 150 watt household style AC outlet, a USB charge port, seat back mat pockets, and folding the seats is easy, locating the lever at the top of the seat and pulling the assembly forward.
All right, and a quick look at the luggage area. Reveals very nice amount of storage with the seats even in the upper right position. You have a reversible floor mat, one with a rubberized side, and the other side has carpet. Compartmentalized storage on either side. You've also got a couple tie down hooks, illumination, a 12 volt power point. And underneath the floor mat, in lieu of a spare tire, you do have the tire inflator kit, which also means a nice amount of covered storage underneath as well. And here's the luggage area with the seats folded. And closing the lift gate is easy. Just press the button in the trim panel. All right, and this does conclude our quick walk around look at the brand new 2017 Jeep Compass. We hope the video was informative. And as always, thanks for watching.